Hi, I'm going to show you how to create a very basic setup of the Moodle Gradebook which has been added to Moodle since version 1.9. For this video I'll be using 1.9 Beta 2, so if you have any older version this might be a little bit different for you. So at first log in as a teacher and then click on the right on your left side panel Grades and then General Settings. Here you can choose what uh, type of users should be mm, shown in the gradebook. Since we're using a basic, since we're doing a very basic setup, let's just take students. This makes a lot of sense anyway. Enable outcomes. It's nothing that concerns us since this is a rather advanced method. User profile report is the basic view with that the user sees when he clicks grades. We leave it at user report. Aggregation position is the position of the column with the ag aggregation of the user's points or grades. Uh, show submitted date for hidden grades. So if the user cannot see any some grades, he'll be viewing the date of uh, submission instead of a minus sign. I'd leave it off if I were you, but you can do anything you want, of course. Enable publishing. And this doesn't mean that you enable publishing mm, at all. It enables you to publish Moodle mm, gradebooks to anyone not only to people logged into Moodle. So if you want to do such a thing, enable this. Here you can set great export display type and this means the format of the grades that will be exported into a file. I think that percentage or letters are the best way to show such data, so let's stick with percentage. If you stick with a real number this would interest you, otherwise not. This is the number of digits behind the comma sign. Primary grade expert methods doesn't concern us, so let's leave it like this and save settings. Next go to grade category settings, where the most important thing is the aggregation method. You can use mean of grades or any of his methods. I don't know what you would like to use, but in my opinion mean of grades is the most popular and best method to do this. So I don't save anything because we haven't changed anything here. And grade item settings. Here you change the basically same thing, but not for exported files, but for viewing them, mm, the data online. So let's stick with percentage as we have before. And here you can show or hide specific columns in the gradebook from other users. The basic setup here is quite alright, so let's save changes. And let's view our gradebook, because that's all we need to do to make it look how we want it to look. Because all the data is collected and added automatically while doing specific tasks and so on. As you can see, everything is shown as percentage. If someone hasn't uh, applied to a task, he has a minus sign. And that's it. Thank you for watching.